Hey everyone, welcome back to another new exciting video. There is a new open source AI model in the market and its name is Hermes 4 and this open source model has proved that a open source model can also beat any closed source model. And here is the benchmark verification percentage of question answers. If you see the mode number in this percentage then you will understand that this model has the great capability to keep answer for all of the questions that we ask to our model and here you see that this is the simple ui but it has a lot of capability here you see that on the right hand side you can control this reasoning memory and completions and also you can put the system prompt here and also you can do this workspace prompt and this model reset completion settings many things and on the left hand side here you see that there is a new chat option so if you click on this new chat you will find this another chat box so this is one chat box and this is another chat box so in this way you can set up multiple chat box and you can run them parallelly okay and also here you see that they have many options uh, one option is this world building this create immersive stories that means you can create any kind of stories with it and next one is this code generation and the third one is this reasoning so let me discuss what is this Hermes 4 here you see that Hermes 4 is a family of large language model LLM. It is developed by NOS Research and described in their Hermes 4 technical report published on this August 5, 2025. And this is the technical report. This is a huge report. I maybe walk you through this, um, this report, but it will make this video very long. So that's why I have just uh, uh, written one summary here and I will discuss that. These models are designed as hybrid reasoning model, contain two handy capabilities. One is the fast direct answer, another one is the step by step thinking route. So it will route it will route to that uh, process. Means if it finds that it requires thinking, then it will think. But otherwise, if it does not require that thing, then it will not think. Okay, it will automatically decide that the hybrid reasoning uses explicit think text which reveal the model's internal reasoning trail before giving a final answer. Now, if I show you that example, here you see that I just ask it this, hey, and here you see that it has thought. So this is a thinking. Hi, how can I assist you today? today? Okay. And now another thing is that they come in different sizes built on Llama 3.1 checkpoints, 14 billion, 70 billion, 405 billion parameter variants. Okay. Now you will find this model on open router also and uh, but before that let me show you another interesting thing here you see that key innovations behind this uh, Hermes 4 first one is this data forage synthetic data via graphs so a graph based system that generates training example by transforming existing content for instance converting a wikipedia article into a wrap so these three are the, this data forage, atropos and this length control. These are the main pillar of this Hermes 4. So if I talk about this first example, which is the data forage, here in this case, they are using this graph based system that generates the training example by transforming existing content. So for example, let's say you have this Wikipedia article. This is the existing content and you can transform that Wikipedia article into question answer pairs and uh, also you can produce one wrap and it produced 5 million samples means the 19 billion token especially heavy on reasoning traces so from this one wikipedia article you will transform the article or that content in such a way with a graph based system that it can uh, produce multiple question answer pair must multiple data now the next pillar of this Hermes 4 is this Atropos Massive Rejection Sampling. What is that? Hermes 4 trains using reinforcement learning with 1000 task specific verifiers. What does that mean? I have found this interesting post on this Atropos. Atropos is NOS reinforcement learning framework. Atropos is an open source reinforcement learning environment by this NOS that has hundreds of gyms like math, coding, games, tool use, vision. Okay, to train and evaluate LLM trajectories via scalable async reinforcement learning loops. In other words, hundreds of places AI can mess around to figure out solutions to specific problems. 
So there are some problems, but there are some masters also like uh, on this math, coding, games and tool use vision and they will decide that which one is best and uh, the one is best, they will give you answer that answer. Okay, it tracks how models think and solve things instead of just state question and answer set. Nos used these environments to generate the data set for Hermes 4 and all in the data set contains 3.5 million reasoning samples and 1.6 million non-reasoning samples. Now the next one is this length control, avoiding wandering thought. So what happens that when you are asking any question to any uh, this thinking reasoning model, sometimes what happens that it goes to that uh, loop it is thinking 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 and it takes around uh, four to five minutes for thinking and in that case what happens that people get frustrated and they have resolved that issue that is most inter interesting and important things here you see that long reasoning churn chains can be excessive the team fine-tuned the model to stop reasoning around 30,000 tokens and improving efficiently and clarity okay and I have found another thing also. Here you see this uh, Hermes 4 is not settled by disclaimers, rules, and being overly cautious, which is annoying as hell and hurts innovation and usability. So they are saying that if you are asking one question to a model, then if that model refuses to answer, uh, to give answer your to your question, then you will not feel right. Okay, so. Here you see, Hermes 4 70 billion is at the complete opposite of the spectrum versus OpenAI's open source model. It also forex more open versus ChatGPT 4.0 if it is open source but refuses all requests in pointless, right? Means you are declaring that your model is open source but uh, for some questions it cannot give answer, it is refusing to give the answer. So it is pointless, right? Not an issue with the Hermes 4. That means if you are asking any question to this Hermes 4, then most of the time you will get the answer. And here you see that this is the percentage of question answers graph. And also they have the great capability with the math also. Here you see that this mathematics, reasoning, logic, code, knowledge, and this uh, creativity, writing, percentage of questions correct by category and uh, this is evaluated with the other models and uh, here you see that Hermes 4 has a lot of capability okay so you should definitely try this model I have given this link in description this is the website go there currently it is freely available for all of the users for the first week they have released this model on 25th August and uh, for the continuous seven days they have kept this model for freely use and uh, one thing you can do that you can edit this prompt here and you can increase the size of this this uh, chat box here and you can ask here that what is your name okay and press enter and you will see some kind of th key thinking box here you see my name is Helon. let me know how can i help you today so they have given this name the dummy name and in this way, you can take the help, write a Python code, okay? And, or you can say the writer JavaScript code, and I can take help this code generation. So they have this code generation facility also. And here you see that I am working parallelly with these multiple options. Help me write clean and efficient code with the best practices for js and what i can ask it that link list if i just ask it and press enter or i can simply ask it uh, this js closer concept okay and press enter and you will see that it is ready to give you that answer it is thinking 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 and as I told you that it has that 30,000 token limits and when it will cross that 30,000 token limit it will stop thinking and it will give you the result so it will not go to that unlimited uh, 
thinking thinking loop okay and here you see yes here you see that i have got the answer and it is a very clean and clear example that it has given okay it has given multiple answers and also that usage is this is good man okay it, it is explaining that also this memory leak concept and over using a closer and this you uh, this uh, output is definitely 101 percent better than this uh chat gpt because here you see that it has given all of the use cases memorization with closer event handling closer and i have asked the same question to chat gpt also but they have given me one use case only uh, the common use case that is one use case but here you see that it has given me multiple use cases where I can use this JavaScript closure concept. In querying also you can use it and also it has given me all of that examples. So I will say definitely that this Harness 4 model has a great capability to beat the other closed source model and uh, you should definitely try that. Please use it and please let me know in the comment section that how this new model Harness 4 was useful for you. So you can watch the other videos also that I have published on our channel. So see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. And if you want to get this type of videos more, don't forget to like and subscribe this channel. Bye bye.